Breaking Barriers Why China's Aviation Engine Tech Keeps Europe and America Awake at Night 35-Ton Thrust Rewrite Sky Rules When Boeing engineers disassembled China's new engine, they found, made in China, stamped on the manual, is this a sci-fi teaser or the end of technological hegemony? German engineers crunched the numbers, the fuel savings from Chinese engines could buy enough Starbucks to caffeinate Europe. While Musk talks about Mars colonization requiring super engines, Chinese engineers smile and point at the globe, let's master intercontinental flights first. Key Takeaways KeyCap 1 Yangtze 2000 engine delivers 35-ton thrust to crush Western rivals while slashing fuel consumption by 15%. KeyCap 2 carbon fiber wings plus quantum encrypted cockpit create a steel Phoenix, 25% lighter than Boeing 787. KeyCap 3 EU scrambles to update aviation standards but can't stop ASEAN's 30 C929 orders flooding China. I, three blades that shattered Western tech dominance. Folks, an American engineer just resigned overnight after dismantling a Chinese engine. Why? Because he witnessed three strikes that obliterated 50 years of Western tech monopoly. First strike, the air comb shaves Western arrogance bald. This 12 to 1 ultra-high bypass ratio fan works like precision hair clippers, surgically trimming fuel consumption by 15%. Boeing's g engine became obsolete overnight. G-engineers trembled our bypass ratio barely reaches 9 to 1. The knockout punch? A 200 kg lighter compressor, equivalent to Airbus A350 ditching four passengers per flight. Airline CEO's eyes lit up like laser beams at an airshow. Second strike, ice armor forged in magma. 1950k turbine temperature? That's hotter than volcanic lava, 1400k. Yet Chinese engineers coat turbine blades with nanoceramic, ice armor, originally developed for spacecraft re-entry. German material scientists turned green with envy, were still stuck on third-gen superalloys while they're using space-grade coatings. Third strike, laser ballet that bankrupts Boeing QC. In Jiangsu's secret workshop, three-meter carbon fiber blades dance under laser precision, 0.06 mm accuracy, making Boeing 787's 0.15 mm standard look medieval. CAS engineers went nuclear, aircraft skin errors now measure one-seventh of a hair's width. Airbus designer Pierre shattered his teacup in Munich, how does their airframe last 60,000 hours when ours barely reaches 44,000? GE's Phoenix project to catch up? They reduced parts from 3,000 to 800, Lego-style simplicity. Honeywell engineers gawked at China's 28 nanometers chips outperforming their 5 nanometers tech. The ultimate humiliation? C929's $120 million price tag undercuts Airbus A350 by 40%, enough to launch three new routes. 2. Market Warfare certification battles and supply chain annihilation. While C929 secures 30 ASEAN orders, Brussels plays a farce, EU aviation authorities reject Chinese certification standards while secretly reverse-engineering C929 avionics. This block-and-copy charade exposes Western desperation. China's counter-strikes. KeyCap 1 Data Iron Curtain Foreign airlines must submit flight data or face airspace bans. Boeing 787 just lost its golden Beijing Paris route. KeyCap 2 Standard Exports Middle East Mutual Certification Deal makes Dubai Singapore Route C929's global debut battlefield. KeyCap 3 Price Slashing Strategy C929's cost advantage lets airlines fund three new routes with savings. Supply chain devastation. SMIC's 28 nanometers chips rival 5 nanometers performance, turning Honeywell's quotes into toilet paper. 
Chinese titanium suppliers now mass-produce 150-ton landing gear components at rock-bottom prices, leaving Raytheon scrambling. 3. Dual Domination, Military and Civilian Tech Supremacy At Zhuhai Airshow's classified zone, America's worst nightmare materializes, Y-1EC transports now pack twin monster hearts with 40-ton thrust, outmuscling U.S. C-17 by two elephant-sized payloads. Quantum encrypted communication systems extend PLA Air Force Command radius beyond physical limits. 1. Military Heart Attack for the Pentagon These modified Yangtze 2000 engines enable 82-ton payloads, 12 tons heavier than C-17. Translation, two extra battle tanks or 300 troops per sortie. Pentagon analysts spilled coffee on satellite images, how did they achieve 1950k turbine temps? Our F-135 engines max at 1800k. Quantum systems now coordinate South China Sea fighters from Beijing, 2000 km command radius leaves Der Spiegel whaling, the aviation Berlin Wall is collapsing. 2. Civilian Tech Revolution Sky Wi-Fi 2.0, terahertz tech delivers 10 gigabits per second at 30,000 meters, faster than your home fiber. EU certifiers gasped, this buries Boeing 787's Wi-Fi in shame. Green guillotine, biofuel hybrids cut emissions 70%. Emirates Airline rejoiced, carbon tax savings by three new planes. AI maintenance, self-healing coatings plus predictive AI reduce failures by 90%. China Eastern engineers laugh, three-day inspections now take 10 minutes. 3. Longevity Sorcery Chinese engineers chase 50,000-hour engine life, enough for C929 to circle Earth 500 times non-stop. Airbus engineers dropped certification docks into coffee, Hours die at 30,000 hours. Are they bending time? Secret Sauce 21 breakthrough technologies from powder metallurgy to plasma welding, previously used to double Russian engine lifespans, now upgraded to Chinese specs. Next time you fly, will you choose EU's glass coffin or China's performance beast with homegrown core tech? Share this. Let the world see how Chinese engines demolish hegemony's walls. Comment below, is 50,000-hour longevity enough to end Boeing's legend?